So I just saw the uh, Lego movie, Ninjago, here at the uh, AMC in Torrance, Rolling Hills, Lamita. And uh, there's some spiritual elements, actually, to it. I was surprised, you know. This is a movie review for Christians. One of the things is finding your inner power, of course. When they talk inner power in the movie, they're talking about your natural elements. Earth, wind, fire, water, things like that. Green. But for Christians, the inner power comes from being in Christ, through Christ. And uh, so that's one thing to keep in mind from the Lego movie. And then there's also the uh, theme of uh, being hosp uh, hospitality to strangers, show kindness to strangers. That's a prayer suggestion, too. Pray about that for others and for yourself. Can you be more hospitable, kind to strangers? And then there's uh, the... Um, need for family of course some some christian groups put too much emphasis on the family above everything else and sometimes that's not good either but we need family if not our own nuclear family but most importantly the christian family sometimes our own nuclear family not everybody's christian not everybody's in christ so it can't always be a cohesive unit if they're not always in christ of course, you always love your family, whether they're Christian or not, but you for sure you need your Christian family for unity. And the green guy in the Lego movie was like the uh, Holy Spirit who unites all the family members and makes it cohesive. So there's that element, too. So you can use your imagination to really make a... Uh, make the Lego movie into a real theological movie. So, good for kids, nothing objectionable. There's no, there's only two humans in the whole movie, and, and the rest are all Legos, animated. And then there's a cat, a real live cat. That's the only uh, other living object. Everything else is a Lego animated. So, Enjoy the Lego Ninjago movie. Look for the theological analogies. And uh, always pray to God while you're watching the movie. Pray the movies. And I also was praying because this is the day after the uh, Mandalay Bay terror, or not, well, you can call it a terror, but it's a attack or massacre, it was the Las Vegas massacre. 58 people were killed. I was praying for that. So there's always news, you know, world news that you can pray for while watching the movie, too. So remember, pray the movies, and God be with you and bless you. Lord, we pray for those without families or without a real good family, either a Christian family or, a, or their own nuclear family. Pray for them. Pray for all of us. None of us have a perfect unity in that regard. And we pray for our inner power, inner faith that comes through you. It comes through only through thee, O oh Lord, our, our Savior, Jesus Christ. Give us the strength and give us that confidence we need to have that inner, inner faith and, and power, but which also comes from unity with our other Christians. Hear our prayer, Lord, in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit.